going on guys? I wanted to tell you about a little special project I've been working on for the past couple months. Actually, honestly about the past year. So with my BRZ, I've gone through a lot of exhaust setups and I have never really been happy with the sound or the look of any of them. Uh, for as cool as the car is, it just didn't feel like it suited. You know, just off the shelf parts basically. I've always been an R35 GTR fan. Uh, I almost bought one at one point, but I ended up getting an Audi instead. Um, uh, an S5, but that's neither here nor there. It's gone now. So what I ended up doing, or what I wanted to do, was I wanted to do a quad exhaust setup, but I wanted to use R35 GTR tips. And this wasn't very easy to do. I basically spent a year hunting for tips off of wrecked GDRs, uh, aftermarket setups, which are really expensive. And basically, after about a year, I found uh, an aftermarket exhaust from an R35 GTR that was wrecked. Um, I got the guy to cut off the tips, do all this. It was interesting because R35 GTRs normally use single tips, but this guy had custom fabbed up one using like, I think they're MagnaFlow tips, which, you know, fuck me, I could have just bought the tips myself, but... You know, you live and you learn. I just want to start here, explain it. Uh, I'm going to show you the before, the after. You just saw what it sounds like on a cold start startup. We do revs, we do flybys or you know, drive-bys, uh, I guess. Uh, drive-by is probably not a good word, but I drive past the camera so you can hear how it sounds. So, a little backstory. I've had almost every kind of setup. You can do a straight pipe to a couple different exhausts. I had uh, when the car was NA. It was on uh, JDL, UEL headers uh, to almost a straight pipe back to an NVIDIA N1. It was fucking loud. And uh, currently it's a very interesting setup because I blew my motor and I had to go back to completely stock for Subaru to give me my new block. So, all right. So, the current setup on the car is the actual, I believe it or not, it's the stock headers, stock overpipe, uh, catless, non-resonated front pipe, uh, catless, non-resonated mid pipe to what used to be an NVIDIA N1, but I custom fabbed, cut off the mufflers, I know, <laughs> NVIDIA N1 muffler delete, uh, and basically what we did was we cut them off and then we did V-bands from there to titanium back to these special tips. And I wasn't sure what it was going to sound like. I was like, it's probably going to be really shitty, honestly. And I was like, I'm going to have to go back and add a muffler later. But surprisingly, it sounds pretty good. So, so yeah. Let's hear it before, and then we'll go to the after cold, after warm, revs, flyby. All right, let's do it. So now that we're out of the city, we're going to see a warm start and some revs. I didn't want to do this where I live for like obvious reasons. It's going to be really loud. And yeah, here we go. Again, this is a warm start. The car's been driven for the past 10 minutes. Alright, well 
I just shot this, but the footage got fucked, so uh, I'm gonna do it again. These are drive-bys drive coming and going. Uh, nothing crazy. It's a private road in Mexico, so. Yep, let's do it. Not bad, pretty good. Uh, sounds good going by. Um, something to note, this car does not have a verbal tune. Uh, I really don't like those. They sound super forced. And uh, usually with a good exhaust, you can just get that effect anyway. Um, so, you know, say no to verbal tunes because it, it sounds cheap and it makes you look like a high schooler. So, all right, good job, let's go. All right. That's it for the video. Uh, I had a lot of fun filming this and editing it. Um, I make this stuff from time to time and I, uh, I'm an editor full time, so I like making videos. Um, if you stuck around or enjoyed it, consider subscribing. Uh, I like to make more stuff, especially BRZ content. So uh, thanks for watching and I'll uh, see you next time. Bye.